I wanted to film a video for you. I don't know. Okay, so the thing is that basically a thrift haul, but technically I wasn't in any thrift store or thing like that. Because the thing is that um, I have actually been thrifting my whole life not knowing about it. Because, okay, look, the thing is that I have not been to any thrift store or stuff like that in, I guess, my entire life. Because the thing is that in Poland and in my area where I live, everybody, like, mothers have their friends that have kids and we're just exchanging like piles of clothes that we don't want anymore but are still reusable like just like in thrift stores but we don't pay for that because you know we just exchange those piles of clothes and it just goes from door to door to like every house and we just pick out the things that we like so recently from technically my aunt I got a few clothes. I wanted to show you like a little bit different type of thrifting. A few of these things are actually really cringy and I don't know why I took them but let's- oh yeah and if you want more of content like this then you can follow me on my social medias or subscribe to my channel. So, okay, so the first go. thing that I- I wanted to say bought but I didn't bought it is this top so actually it's pretty much too big for me but it's so flowy and like comfortable that for summer it's just great i love the like three four sleeves i don't know mid length i don't know how to call it i just love this top i've been wearing it for the past three days yeah that's a lot i'm going to put it to the washing now but seriously i love this top and i'm so happy that i've picked it out so what i picked out are these really flowy skirts and wait i'm going to get the other one so they're like floral and i basically love the patterns on them okay i don't but i love the type of material like it's so like it's great for summer it's just like this really thin material the thing is that they are too big for me so i'm going to definitely make them smaller so you will see that in a thrift flip that probably will go up yeah so both of them are actually the same only the pattern is a little bit different enough of talking about them let's get on okay here we have this really pretty floral dress um but the problem with this is again it is too big for me so i'm planning to just make it a bit smaller basically oh my Okay, then I got this, and I'm not even going to try this on, because the only thing that I liked about it is the material, because, you see, it's this, like, really, I don't know, plushy thing, I don't know how you call it, it's this plushy thing, and it's like, I don't know, I want, I tried it on, and it looks really bad because of this part up here, because it's so big, like, you can see, like, it's too big for me, so... I don't know, I just got it for the material because I will probably make a pencil case or something out of it so this is like not going to the clothes section, it's going to the material section because yeah. Okay, the next thing, okay, for this I'm actually pretty excited. Okay, so this is like a bumper which has pants. It's so big that I cannot even show it to you here. Okay. Um, Again, this is too big for me, but the material is, like, not actually hard to redo. So, I'm going to pull it up a little bit and make the strap, like, smaller so that it would actually fit my petite waist. The next thing, you know what, guys, I actually don't remember what I have here, so it's good that I'm looking through all of this. It's this plain white t-shirt that's actually, like, kind of cropped. I don't know. It's just like not a normal t-shirt. It's like a little bit more baggy. I don't know. Just like you can never have enough white plain t-shirts. Um, am I right? Okay, the next thing is this. 
sweater, which I thought was so cute. And actually, the material, it's so soft, like, I could sleep in it. I could cuddle it as a teddy bear. But, yeah, like, these big cutouts on the chest aren't technically my thing because I don't have boobs and I don't have anything to show. But my mom said that it's okay. And I'm not looking as bad as I usually do. <laughs> So I decided to keep it because I love these stripes and I love the material and I love everything about it so I'm going to keep it. The next thing is actually pretty risky. <laughs> okay, it's this thing. Okay, so you basically like throw it on something. Um, the thing about it is that these buttons are so ugly. Like these are like the these are imitating pearls and nobody likes them so I'm just going to cut them and we will see I'm going to try this on with like random things like seriously guys just because I got it doesn't mean that I will wear it so I actually have not tried this on yet so you you see the first try on right now okay I don't know what to think about this at all I found this and Stuff like these are really like in right now like everybody wants them and so I don't know this is just too out there for me but we will see since I got it like underneath on top of a white t-shirt I don't know we will see we will see how this will work I don't know next thing Okay, it's pretty much the same thing as the floral one that you've seen. Yeah, nothing interesting. Okay, the next thing is this. And seriously, I was thinking about this as to just like wear it as kind of a jacket. Like, not to not like close it up. You see right here how I wear it. I just pictured it just like on top of like a crop top or something or maybe like like um how is it called tied at the middle and i never tried it on so if you don't have the like trying on part right here it means that i was looking really bad and that i will never wear it okay the next two things are pretty similar but i didn't know what to do with them okay so i've got this sweater zip up sweater that's this turquoise color that i actually pretty much have in my room technically it's matching um the thing is that i hate this part right here i don't know it's like imitating a turtleneck which i hate but the material is really soft and i took it because i took whoa clothes are flying everywhere this white one which as you can see looks pretty good and I thought that like having a white sweater like this is a good idea because I don't have anything white to put on top of things so I took the other one as well because it's just more comfortable and okay the next thing I will definitely keep it's this romper which has a floral print I don't know just um, actually this is like looking a little bit weird when it's on me but overall it's really cute okay the next thing oh yeah I'm excited for this I'm I am excited for this I am excited it's this great sweater and when I saw it I was like yes this is going to look great it's um i think as i remember it's a little bit too big on the like arm area for me i don't know i think that way i don't remember actually i was trying this on like four days ago but i'm keeping this because it will look fabulous with like a tee or like a tank top the next thing is this jumper sweater thing which i actually picked out i don't like the rabbits i'm not a huge fan of rabbits and crowns but it was really soft and really big so it's like the you know like the oversized 
hoodie. Okay, this thing. I'm still not sure if I'm going to keep. Cause I looked pretty good in this, but again, the big neck part was confusing me uh, about should I keep it or should I leave it, but I don't know. I think that the like turtlenecks and everything are in right now, so maybe I'm going to keep it. I'm not sure. This thing, I'm actually scared to show you how I look in this because I'm looking really bad. But I kept it for the materials. The thing is, that it is this weird jacket with puffs right here. So I'm looking crazy in this because first of all, it's too big for me. Second of all, the like puffy arms, shoulders, I don't know, look really, really weird. I thought that I'm actually going to like get inside of this jacket and cut out the puffs Okay, going on with that jacket, I also picked out another jacket, which looks way worse and the puffs are way bigger, but I'm going to try to do something with it because obviously this is not looking as pretty, so maybe like this one will go first and this one will go second so that if I will ruin something the first try, I'm just not going to cry if I will ruin this because it's not as pretty as this, so yeah. But if it's going to turn out cool, who knows? Okay, so I also took, I actually don't know why I took this. I hate this print. This dress, wait, this is the back, this is the front. This dress, which is a little bit too big for me because I don't have any boobs for this to hold on. And I don't know what's this weird part right here. You, you see this? I don't know what this is, uh, but it has the same thing on the back, like right here. The next thing that I got, I am, whoa, it's on the left side. Uh, this is really pretty. It's like this weight, it's this crop top, and yes, it is, yes, it is too big for me, but I'm going to just make these straps smaller, and then it's going to work perfectly. Oh yeah, this is so pretty, and I'm so happy with that. Then I've got these two t-shirts, which is this white one and this black one. And basically I got them to crop them like somewhere around right here to make them like crop tops. That one I hated the print on, but I thought that, yeah, let's try and make it cute. Like, it's a challenge for me. The sweater. Cute. The second thing is this top. Not too cute, but because I hate this part, but the black and white is looking nice. This top, really cute. This top, pretty cute as well. Also, she gave me this turtleneck. I hate turtlenecks, but I've got, I don't know, like five of these last summer, and all I did was just like cut these parts, and then I wanted to sew this part so that I could just have like a normal sweater but I never did I still have them so I'm probably going to do that and that's all thank you all guys so much for watching I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did make sure to subscribe to my channel and like it see you next time guys